642 now. Happy Saturday, everyone. It is cold outside this morning. A lot of areas are in the teens at last check. That includes mostly Colorado Springs. Light traffic in front of American Furniture Warehouse at I-25 and Fillmore. Sun is just now cresting the eastern horizon. And it won't be too long before it's uh, getting pretty bright out there if you're looking out towards the east. Temperatures in most cases, as mentioned, are pretty chilly. We have a lot of single digits and teens out there. You can find a few 20s, mainly south of the Arkansas River. We've seen that around Walsenburg and Trinidad. Nearer to the mountains, we have a couple of spots that are just a little bit warmer. And the clouds are actually starting to increase from the west, and that trend is going to continue today. Notice future cast shows the clouds overspreading the area as we move into the afternoon. So we'll have a lot of shade at times and that always you know affects how it feels so the next question is wind we don't expect a lot of that future cast is showing that uh, mostly light wind speed should be expected across the area today we could have a few pockets near the mountains where the breeze is up to around 10 to 15 miles an hour which you know isn't nothing but compared to what we have sometimes around here this time of year that's pretty benign wind I think we'll have 40s and lower 50s in most cases perhaps the far eastern plains we could manage to hit the middle 50s we get up high enough into the mountains, we'll have 30s. But most of our local mountain communities and southern valleys will probably creep their way up into the 40s. And while we're expecting a good bit of cloud cover this afternoon, we're not expecting any precipitation to fall from the clouds. We're just going to blot out the sun a little bit. And then tonight, we'll end up probably seeing a few more breaks develop in the clouds here and there. But we'll call for a partly cloudy night, all things considered. And as we head into tomorrow morning, and, and probably perhaps tonight, we could have some pretty colors in the sky, both the sunset tonight and the sunrise tomorrow morning with clouds floating around. And, and these will be a little bit higher in the sky, maybe some mountain wave clouds, and they tend to get pretty colorful at those times of the day. It will again be pretty cold tonight, maybe not quite as cold as it has been this morning as more areas hang out to 20s along the front range, but we'll still get some low-lying areas to dip back into the teens, and we'll still find a mixture of single digits and teens up across the mountains and mountain valleys. So it's de definitely going to be plenty chilly overnight tonight. If you have to be outdoors, just want to make sure you're dressed appropriately. There is that sun as seen from our Colorado Lottery camera up on top of Cheyenne Mountain out there on the eastern horizon right now. And again, as you look to the east, you really don't see much cloud cover, but uh, we do expect that the clouds will be filling in here over the next several hours. Uh, we're tracking some cold air, really, as we head through the work week. And periods of wind will probably, you know, put a little bit more of a bite into the air than the numbers would do just by themselves. And we'll have a couple of chances for at least a little bit of light snow. And we'll talk more about that coming up in our extended forecast soon. Riley, back to you.